water and then water will be in the gaseous state and you have to know that water can exist in three states solid liquid gas so here water that gives it will be in gaseous state and then sulfur dioxide gas already mentioned sulfur dioxide gas so so2 gas now after writing the chemical equation you need to balance so now check it check it the number of atoms on the number of atoms on the product side and the reactant side reactant side and product side so now check it hydrogen 2 hydrogen 2 then sulfur 1 sulfur 1 then oxygen here 2 but you have to count here together together total number of oxygens on the product side together together you have three so three and two it's not balanced so to make it balanced you have to make some more easy tricks that is make it even number so that you can put easily so here is two and here is one three adding together three so to make it four just put here two put here two after putting here two why i start from oxygen because oxygen has more number of atoms so oxygen two and here after putting two it will be count together how many four and then on the product side you have four oxygen then now on the reactant side come to the reactant side you have only two oxygen atom so put here two after putting two two times of two you will get total four atoms so you balance oxygen you balance oxygen after you balance oxygen now you come to hydrogen hydrogen has how many number from the uh, look at the product side at product side you will found four two times of two four atoms then come to the reactant side you have already two so make it four so put here two and then after you put two then now sulfur sulfur becomes two times sulfur become two times and here at your sulfur at your sulfur at your sulfur you have only one then how will you do you can change your sulfur change your sulfur two times change your sulfur two times so when you change your sulfur two times now your oxygen again become chance such thing will arise okay such thing will arise so don't think that you are wrong this method of balancing is called heat and trial method that means you can put any number to make it your first trial uh, success but if it is not success you can cut your numbers and change it so after putting two to balance sulfur now your oxygen number change so think your oxygen number change two times of two you have now four and then this two all together six all together six oxygen atom total six on the product side and now you have how many on the reactant side you have four so four can change to six easily four can change to six so no need of putting another plus two instead of that you can easily cut your two number and then you can put here three after putting three three times two you will get six so this is how you balance your equation so uh, keeping like this it will it will not look nice so you can write another one more time finally and finally you can write your correct balance chemical equation like this so this is your last final chemical balance equation you can cut your numbers the first number that you put is not the final so that's why the method of balancing of this chemical equation is also called heat and trial method that means if the number is not matching you can cut it and try another one more number to make your atoms balance i think all of you uh, understand if i am speaking so fast also you just uh, uh, has the ask your doubt to me and then uh, if you understand up to this including uh, yesterday's session of balancing the chemical equation and uh, i will give you some uh, more uh, classwork to do that means this will be improved when you do more practice of balancing so i will give you some classwork and some homework and you have after doing it you have to show to me thank you